Hi everyone, I'm Nidhi, Senior Product Manager on the Confluence Cloud team, and I'm excited to present to you getting started with Confluence Public Links. We know that Confluence is the collaborative hub for many teams, but not all collaboration happens within the boundaries of a single organization. So presenting to you the Confluence Public Links feature that allows you to share any Confluence page with anyone broadly across the internet via a simple public link. So how does this work? Let's take a look. The marketing and public relations team at Nidrock has created this press release, launching their new winter collection of Nidrock shoes. They have added images and rich formatting to make this Confluence page engaging. Now, as their PR specialist, I usually share this press release with the media agents in advance of the media conference. This time, I'll be using the Confluence public link feature to easily share this Confluence page with all of the media agents. I navigate to the share dialog where I notice this public link footer. I can turn the public link on right here. I confirm that I do want to make the content on this page public. And that's it. I now have the public link for this page. It's automatically copied to my clipboard, but I also have the option to view this public link here or copy the public link again. It's as simple as that to generate the public link for this page. Now let's take a look at what the media agents will see once I share this public link with them, either via email, Slack, or any other means. I've opened a new tab where I'm pasting that public link. And that's it. The media agents will be able to see the same Confluence page with all of the rich content formatting options that Confluence provides, such as images, as well as alignment options. This also has all of the exciting information about this new winter collection. We notice that the left navigation with the page tree is absent on this, and the top navigation with the editing tools is also not present, providing this clean, very nice view only version of that Confluence page. I can easily view all of the information that was in that page right here using this public link. Now going back to the internal version of the page, in order for this option of being able to turn on the public link for content, there are two prerequisites. We wanted to ensure that admins have full control over what content is made public. The first prerequisite is that public links must be allowed at the site level. This means that a product admin must allow public links in the global permissions within the product settings. The second prerequisite is that public links must be allowed in that particular space. This means that within space permissions, public links must be enabled. The space admins can easily see all the content in their space that is public right here in the centralized location. And that's it. It is super simple to be able to share any Confluence page broadly to the internet using this Confluence public link. The team and I are excited to see how you use this Confluence public link feature. It will be generally available in all Confluence cloud sites on a paid plan, which is standard, premium, and enterprise. Join us in the Atlassian community discussion using the link below. Go ahead and give Confluence Public Links a try right now.